Hello and welcome to another episode of Training Atlanta. Today we are trying round two of Nad helping me in the kitchen and why we make the roll up sahina and we make some two different kind of bargani for you all. And um, so here we go. Hi Wish everybody. Us luck. <laughs> so I'm leaving Nad with you. Nad, tell yeah. them what you're doing while I Okay, so I this, this is the dal for the baigani and the sahina. So I'm going to mix some flour to my grinder. This is what, one cup and? This is one cup, yes. Mm -hmm. So three cups. No, they half cup. Half? I half. That is a half cup. Measuring so, four. Mm -hmm. What are you doing with that? I am just making a little bit of chutney. Okay. Then I'm going to okay. add some garlic to this. Some green seasoning. Some salt to taste. You're going to some only warm water here. Yeah? Oh, I didn't put it up. You didn't put it up? Nope. Let's see if we have warm water here. <coughs> okay, give it a couple minutes. Mm -hmm. And you could go ahead and cut up the bygone while, and while I do that, that is here. coming to a hot. So this is what we're going to make with the roll up bygone. Yeah. This is, she's going to make this one, like the crunchy one, the, and that's the one yeah. you're making it, the mm -hmm. crunchy. Yeah. I don't like the one where you just rub the flour over, Nadi. Yeah, me too. I, I like this like one it. more. I, yeah, I, this one just tastes like what I know and we grew up eating. Yeah. That one, I never grew up eating bagani with that much flour. You, my love? No. I never <laughs> see that until I got older. <laughs> But by then, I was just set on my ways already and had a good amount of bad ways. So I put in half of this pepper in one mango there so that it wouldn't be spicy. I'm going to put a little bit of this green seasoning here, like about a, a half a teaspoon. I'm going to put some here, half of that. And this is my bag and I'm working. I'll tell you about that in a while. Meanwhile, I add some garlic in this. And a little bit of green seasoning in this too. You don't have to add too much because in the middle flour already have it. Mix, mix, mix. Ready? So oh, you wait until now. Yeah, it's, it's ready for boiling for you. This is as hot as they go get for you. You can't hold hotter than that. Nah, okay, look at here. And before you put it in, check it. Put, your, put some and then check the, the temperature of the water. Because you didn't do a complaint. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah no, it's the right hand you're using anyways. Uh -huh. Right, so you don't need to. I take up my. Yeah. Is it hot enough? Yeah, it's yeah, too yeah. hot. No, that's good. Okay, perfect. So while Nad is doing that, Nad, let me move out Nad so that all you can see. I know she'll clean. <laughs> so you all can see what she's doing. <clears throat> so I put some water, hot water, and mix. Do you want turmeric or you're good? No, no. You're good. And uh, nothing else, no ancha masala, no jeera, nothing else mm -mm, in that. Mm -mm. And uh, this is going to be used for this, uh, for the baigani and, and for the sahina. Yeah. Awesome. So if the sahina is too much, I would say fry like maybe five pieces or so, six pieces or how much. Mm -hmm. And then you could roll the rest and put it away for another time. Yeah. Instead of doing a lot of work, mm -hmm. because you remember the, at the end of the month is my birthday next month, and um, I thought I'd invite the kids. So whatever we have, we'll cook it out. Yeah, they will love that. Yes, not a lot, but mm -hmm. so don't make a lot today because there's nobody but me and you, and Shafik and, and Peter coming over mm -hmm. in a little bit. <coughs> so, so one not no baking powder, nothing, right? Um, no yeast, no baking powder, no. nothing. Okay, so one not is doing that. I have some mango here that I cut up. I have a little piece of pepper, uh, less than a little half. I have some green Just seasoning. Water, I have some garlic. Water. And I'm going to put a little bit of water because just to make it, I don't want it too much running. And I'm going to grind this. Ok, 
Okay. I want some salt in that. So how are you going then, Adi? Good, good, good. Okay. <clears throat> so I put about a teaspoon, full level teaspoon of salt. I put a little more water because it's not grinding properly and I'm going to grind it out. So guys, the mix till it become a paste like this. Let that sit for a minute. Wash my hands. So Nadi made this coconut chutney the other day. So we have coconut chutney as well. This is good. But you want a little more pepper. <laughs> pepper is not hot. Not hot. So I'm gonna put a half of the thing again and see. And I think it wants a little, I would say, Nadi, just a little touch of sugar. Mm -hmm. Mango is a little bit sour. Sour. Nothing too, too much. So maybe just a little teaspoon. Nothing too much. And you go ahead while I'm doing this. Okay, I'm going to start to roll this thing now. Just paste it like this. <clears throat> okay. okay. You want to make sure it gets everywhere so that when you put another leaf on top of it. Mm -hmm. You want anything else? Mm -hmm. Good. I'll leave it here right there, right, right? Oh, that's good. We're done with that. Should I put in a spot of pepper? Maybe be too much? Mm -hmm. okay. okay, perfect. It will so, be extremely too spicy. I will kite it. Okay. So let me just finish this. And I'm done. The chutney is done. So that is how quick and easy that was. Mm -hmm. But the other day, when I told you that Nad and Hai had made everything and then the machine didn't work, we had made the boiled chutney. And when everything happened and the machine didn't work, we had all the sauces remain so i made this one fresh because this you have to make fresh but the one that we boil i had made already and i had it in the refrigerator so you will have to see me make that another day because i wasn't going to make another batch when i already have a batch there but i'm going nowhere so you will absolutely see me make that another time yeah so everybody you met my oldest sister yesterday Dira, who lives in Tobago with her, her husband, because he is from the Netherlands, but he said that he was tired of being cold, so he wanted to go to a place that is warmer now, so they moved to Tobago where he could be warm, yeah, and he's <laughs> comfortable there, so that is done. That is totally, completely finished. That's just to eat now. Yeah. And That's that the best is. part tonight is when we yep. eat it. <laughs> and I am so hungry. I don't know about you. Yes, but I, I had am. a piece of bread. It's the only thing I had for the day. So I am hungry. And I had some, a piece of cake, but I didn't like it. I had some bojangles for lunch. Oh, wow. How did you get bojangles? The kids took you? Yeah. Oh, nicely done. Mm-hmm. Nicely done. Wow. Okay. So while Nad is doing that, I am going to tell you, stay right there, I am going to tell you about this. Now, this is a bagani that my mom made when we were kids and made as, as, as far back as she went until she stopped cooking, which was not maybe 10 years ago maybe. Mm -hmm. And uh, even when Nad got married and come by us, and Nad used to cook. Nad had never seen anybody done this one. No. Nope, this is a different kind of bygone. So what you do, you take a bygone and you cut it into small finger pieces like this. You know, you just cut it up and you cut it in this kind of piece. Now, you could cut it big, you could cut it small, you could cut it. But basically what it is, is small fingers. You have to cut like fingers. So this is how it's going to be. You cut it like this and okay 
So you see how this is. Now you could leave it big like this or you could cut it small and fry it quick, which is the way I choose to do it today. Because as I just said, I am hungry. So I am ready to eat. Inside here, I have a little salt that I put earlier on. And then inside here, I have a little green seasoning that I had. And then I'm going to put a little bit of garlic. A little bit, like a half a teaspoon of garlic. Because remember, this green seasoning does have garlic. And... And let it season enough, just enough for it to soak in a little bit. Because I think I'll, I, I, I'm, I think, I think this would be big. more than enough seasoning for this one. Now, this is all that you put in this. You put, you're just seasoning the bygone lightly. Because after you have to coat the bygone in a curry slurry and fry. So, that is that is there for now. While that is doing. I'm going to get this bowl and in this bowl I'm going to put some flour now you can put any kind of flour you can put this flour but I happen to have this dal flour um, chana chana flour that is really and truly it is flour it is light like a flour I use this when I'm making polori because I don't like it with white flour too much so I use it when I'm making polori and um, and this is what I will soak that in. I will so it's something like when you're making fry fish. You have this. This is exactly what this is. You the season it like if it's fish. The only difference in it, when I'm done, I'm going to season it a little more with the curry and some little other spices. But for right now, this is what this doesn't have to season because it's uh, this is already seasoned. So here we go. And as then now you are yeah. getting that done there. Mm -hmm. So this is how I do it. I roll it. And it's not a big one because we are making a lot today. You have to roll it as tight as possible. That's a beer ready to cut and fry now. <laughs> I told my sister coming over to, um, to make this with you here. Mm. She said, be careful, your belly get big enough. Why? <laughs> Only only cooking and eating. <laughs> oh, oh, Big up yourself, Rina. Yeah, she is silly. And your mom? Yeah, and my mom too. And Monica. Big up all You yourself. want this there to cut it? Yeah. You want to put it, bring that there? I'll bring it, I'll bring it. You sure? Yeah. Okay, whatever works for you. You tell me and I can do. All right, bring it here. I'll cut it here over here on my sub. Bring the one, I'll bring it Let me just move this for mm -hmm. you. So it won't be dirty, <coughs> clothes and stuff. You want to light up now? I'm going to. I'm going to just wash my hands. Out Nari, of this. Yeah. we work so much. Uh -huh. I doubt we have time to get fat. I don't think that so. That much, because when we, we are not here, we are constantly yeah. on our foot standing up. Yep. And Friday and Saturday, we start up there for hours. Mm -hmm. And we want... always move in. Yep. So we really don't have the time. You want this night? Yeah. We okay. really yeah. don't have the time. So we are good there. You mm -hmm. have this thing here to put on this for you. So you will have oh, lights. Yeah. We need the lights. Yes. And you can start there. And give me the bowl to put it when we fry it. When we fry it, okay, I'll take care of it. Mm -hmm. I'll get you a big bowl. Do I put napkins in it? Yes. So you could suck the oil up. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cut him, cut him, cut him. Somebody was asking me the, again the other day if these were glass Pyrex. And no, they are not Pyrex, they are hard plastic, that, and I got them at the Walmart. So that is what. That is. 
see, cut it like that, and then you paste it there. Something like this, or something like this, or a tongue, uh, a tongue. And when the oil hot, we'll just throw it in and fry. Like something like this? Yeah. Okay, perfect. Okay, and this is here. I like mine thin. Thin and thin? Yeah. If it could, if it can't, I would take. But anyhow, I could blow down the heat and I could yeah, fry yeah. it. Mm -hmm. So you could take your time. Take your time and, and fry it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, that oil is ready. It's ready? Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. Continue and I will let it, I'll leave it until it starts cooking and then I'll turn it down. You want it hot and that it won't burn if it gets too hot to put? That's yeah. good, that's good. You can take it and go. Yeah, it's yeah. frightening if it's too yeah. hot. It will get brown outside and, and it will cook, cook inside. inside. And this is something half to cook. cook inside, yeah. Mm -hmm. Because it is scratched, yeah? Yeah. If you don't cook, this is scratch. Yeah. You don't have to put no lime and thing in it when you're cooking it. Mm -mm. You just have to take your time, cook it yeah. slow and low. Some people might want to put lime if they want, but I don't. And then some people does um cook the bhaji and thing before. Yeah. But I I never steam seen it. you do that. Steam yeah, it. I've never seen you done that. I don't steam it. Yeah, I never seen that. And Sharda does make it too and I've never seen She's that steaming. done. You don't have to yeah. You have plenty. So I'm gonna turn this down a little. Mm hmm Or oh, you want me to let it cook first and then yeah, turn it down. Okay, so you get hard. Yeah. And then I'll turn it down. Okay, I like that. Okay. All right. Okay, that looks awesome. Okay. You could put a couple more there. Because I'm after you don't put all, mm -hmm. I'm not putting any more. We're making one fry with this. Yeah. Three, four. You can get all right. It's, it's, I hope my sister Jennifer and Jazz is having a good time in um, oh, yeah. Florida because yeah. they went away for Jazz's birthday and they gone fishing because my sister Jennifer, her yeah. favorite thing in the whole wide world is to go fishing. She buy a whole camper so she can go fishing. What put one on? Because I'm going to eat the ones with a lot. I hope you know that. I know rice where you like. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to tell a lie. Oh, now nah, it looks beautiful. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yep, yeah. like that. You see it, people? That's Nadi there <laughs> with that little fingers, and she does all of this magic. Absolutely phenomenal. Those little fingers does magic. Yep. So next month is my birthday, so I asked Nadi if she'll come over, and we'll invite all the kids, and we'll make some. But we have some sahina. We wasn't going to make, but seeing that we have it, we'll fry it out. And some baigani and some alu pie and some doubles and some polori. All and the good stuff. Yeah. And we'll bring the kids over. All the, um, not only my kids, her kids, my sister's kids, you know? mm -hmm. And let the kids come and eat. So. Nice and done, Nadi. Nice and done. See that, love? Mm -hmm. How pretty that is? Let's turn this down a little bit here. Yeah. One, mm -hmm. right. One more. You That's think? it. Yeah, this is it. Could fit one more. One, two, three, four, five, six. How much you want? One or two? One. So that's enough. Yeah. Because I need two. Peter need two. You need two, and mm -hmm. I want to that. So we are good. Leave it right there. You want to get something to wrap that? What yeah. You, what have you used? Foil. 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 Plus wrap and then foil. Oh, well, we'll have to wrap it later because all of yeah. that will be out in the garage. Mm -hmm. So just leave it in top here until we are done. Yeah. And then I'll go out, traffic will go outside and bring plastic wrap and foil 
and the, that is cold now. The water is cold. Okay. So while that is frying, that will take about at least ten minutes to fry because we'll turn it back again yeah. and let all the water be, um, fry out of it. You know, we have the chutney here. Now this is the chutney I was telling you about that um, we made where well, Nada and I made the last set of the same food that didn't work out. And we have all this chutney left. So we are going to eat some of this and then I'm going to put the rest away. Let me get some that I can put in a container like this and we'll eat that now because we need more than this. Plus we have that chutney plus we have the coconut chutney that Nada made the mm -hmm. other day. Coconut chutney. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that is here. That's more than enough. That is here. This is the mango chutney that we boiled. And what we did, I'm going to tell you what we did, but I'm going to show you another day. We peeled the mango. No, we did not peel the mango. We cut the mango up and we boiled it just like that with a little turmeric. A little sugar, a little curry, a little um, jeera, pepper and garlic and bandana. And then we um, blend it up. And that was that. Okay, let that go. While that is doing, you want to start pacing the... Um, you they want some water? The, no, no, no. Okay. I mean, yeah, you yeah, want yeah, some no, paper no. towel to clean mm -hmm. it. Look at there. I use it here in mine because I know. Okay. Okay. And you could do it right there. Mm -hmm. And we are ready. How many things here? So what? it wouldn't be in your way. What? Okay. That now. I thought I'd see if it's half a day. I was going to put it back here so it wouldn't be in your way. Let me try, let me Let me put that heater. Put up the heat a little bit. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you're going to do that. We are back up here, so just give me a this. Okay. <clears throat> you can't do that. Mm -hmm. I could do. So I could put mine here. Yeah. And it could soak. Yep. So as I have this fingers here, you could leave it in the other tell you the quarters, you could put it in the fingers, whichever works for you. And inside this bowl I have curry, I have turmeric, I have anchar not anchar masala, jeera. Because and that's what inside you have. You notice it's not a little bit, it's a lot. Because this I am going to I might use all, but this is how this is. You 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 have to season this. You you Put this like this and you season it. Actually, I'll have to use not. I'm thinking I'll need all of this. Yeah. This is how this goes. Remember, I did curry paste. Yes. Okay. Okay. So leave it, let it soak a little bit while Nad is finishing that. Just let it just soak so it will get softer and the curry is going to stick to it and we'll get with that in a little bit. Now, Ooh, I most good. likely, I will have to put a couple drops of water in that. I am thinking for it to, um, to stick a little more, but mm -hmm. let's see. If it let go some water before I ready, and if it's not, then I'll show you what to do from there. But this way to eat bygone is one of my favorite. But I'm lying because <laughs> everywhere to eat bygone is my favorite. <laughs> Anyhow, I, I love bygone. I love it stuffed with meat. I like it in baba ganoush. I like it. Um, well, my husband takes me to this um, Mediterranean restaurant called uh, Rumi's Kitchen. Boy. Those people make the best bygone choker. They don't call it bygone choker, but they make the best bygone choker. So, honey, we can take this from here. You know, you can sit. Me and Nat could get this. Because you've been going all the time. <laughs> me and Nat got this. I promise you we yeah, got this. Yeah, once the camera is up and working. Yeah, I promise you we got this. That's all we need. Mm -hmm. We're okay. good to go. Okie dokie. Let's eat them more. More? More. Okay. Nice. Oh, yeah, nice. Mm -hmm. It's crispy. It's See? nice. Yeah. I like it.
Iyo hak nan polahan me kau ta am ayan. Pola do same thing. Okay. Same thing ka bet. So, I'm going to take literally when I told you I'm going to take a tablespoon of water. I'm going to measure it. A little tablespoon of water and add to this. I may need to put more, but I don't want to put too much. I can I can't I don't want it too too wet where it's messing up the oil. Mm -hmm. So a little more. So that is about three tablespoons. I think we are good here, Nadi. Yeah. I think we are good here. Oh yeah. That is paste up already there. Mm -hmm. So you see that there, that is pasty. Leave it there just before I start cooking. I'll put a little bit of water again, just a little, and then I'll start flouring it literally, like how you do fish. You start flouring it. I have this flour here, and I'll start flouring it and put it. And you cook it in a little high heat, not too much a low heat because it will suck oil. So you yeah. don't want that. That's not like what Nad have there. Nad food wouldn't suck oil, but this will suck oil. Mm -hmm. And this is so good. That's the only thing with it. Yeah. Baigan is supposed to be. Yeah, but that, that way, I love it. This is my favorite way to eat baigan. But I like choka too a lot. Eh? Yeah. I do. I love choka. Oh, dal and rice and baigan choka. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if I like dal and rice and baigan choka now. It is good. I, I don't know. Paul used to make it and I don't know. Mm -hmm. I like Paul food a lot, but only his baigan. He stick that food processor and he's mashed mash it up. Yeah. Fine. And I just didn't understand that. I told him a million times <laughs> just to mash it up a little bit, but he doesn't listen to me. Oh, nah, that's coming good. Yeah. You sure I done? No, no, no. I no, that is not done. Yeah. Then so nice good. color, yeah. Yeah. I put up the heat. I can mm -hmm. put up the heat a little more now on the side. Yeah. Bun, but not too, too much. I want the bun. So. Three quarter. It's looking pretty light, maybe. Yeah. It is. Not it you, is not light. No, no. <laughs> Seriously, it looks nice, Nadi. Yeah. It looks really nice. You want something to drink? Yeah, yesterday was hot. You needed something to drink, but the day, huh? Mm -mm. But yesterday, really, when I came over. Oh, yeah. wow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that looks so good. That looks so good. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Look at that one. Mm-hmm. I think you should let it cook, but turn it over one more time. Yeah. And cook because I hope it cook enough. Yeah. You don't want it to scratch. Cool, yeah. That's the only thing. Last time it didn't scratch. It did not. No, no it didn't. See? Not that it didn't scratch. Not at all. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, you know what they say. A we watch pot to, does not cook. We watch them to see which one is the bigger one. <laughs> they say a watch pot doesn't cook. Hey, we had a chocolate was good, girl. Thank you. Wow, that chocolate was good. When I got home last night, I poor one time. <laughs> I am not a chocolate eater, you know. Really? I eat a piece of it. Mm. I don't know. I like it has some chocolate I like. I like a very dark chocolate mm -hmm. um, with, the, the, with the pepper sauce, the chili oil. You have a, there, there, there's make up pepper with a chocolate with chili pepper. Really? And it'll be sweet but spicy. I like that. Mm, but I other than that. that, I'm not a big chocolate. I love, I love chocolate cake though. Boy, do I love chocolate cake. That's good no, no. Let's say it one more time and let's see. And then you can take it out. No, that's okay. Not, it didn't go in very, very much longer. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Did you turn this one too? Mm-hmm. You know who I haven't seen in years, Nadi? Who? Mr. Tony Tempo. Yeah. I, Tony boy, if you're listening to me out there, you Hi. know, I think your Big friends still reach out to me, man. <laughs> we are friends. We've been friends all of our long time. Long, long time. Uh -huh. And Becky reached out to me, Karoshi. So I'm looking forward to Becky coming to make some food with me. She, um, she's beginning to feel better. So as soon as she's back and up and about, she's going to come and you all will meet Becky Karoshi. And I make 
I am. Um, I want to make for you something that I love. A nice Louisiana gumbo. Ooh. I am making some Louisiana gumbo. I have a recipe that I like it. And um That would be very yeah, nice. It's really nice Nadi. You have to come and get to eat that. Definitely. Okay. That is awesome. Oh, shut up. <laughs> That is so good. Oh boy. I can't hold it All yet. Right. It is going to the next so I'm going to leave that we're going to the you. next part now. And that is going to be all is um slow down, man. Yeah, so it's slow. So that's now let me just clean up that oil for you. It is so good. Okay, go ahead. The bagan a little small, so yeah. But just got that. That's the last of char. That's mm -hmm. um tree. That's the last of char. That tree. We just want and we pick that out of char. That tree. Fresh. We pick the baji. We pick all of that, and it um and we brought it here. So it's really the end of the planting time. Fresh off the garden. Mm hmm. Put one more tablespoon of oil. I mean, of water. Um, water again. Just need to stick there. Let's see? Mm -hmm. That's it. Not a drop more. Put that away. Put that away. Mm -hmm. And then. Mm -hmm. I need some breeze, Mari. Hot. I need some breeze. I'm sweating. I am not. I know. You're so <laughs> lucky. My husband bought me these little fans that I have all over the house. And we turn you see one. Mm -hmm. It works here. Everywhere. So good, that mm. is my oh, I'm gonna say my favorite. All of them is my favorite. I love Baiganari. I know, I don't care for Sahina, I can't lie. Mm -hmm. I don't care, but I love Baigan. Anyhow, you feed me Baigan, it's good. You know what? I don't care too much for stew Baigan, like when they make it sadder. Mm. I prefer Baigan with curry. Really? I eat the stew, eh? You know who makes the best stew? Mm. Um, pal curry, mm -hmm. my girlfriend Diana. Really? But she's been a vegetarian for a long time. Let me tell you, that woman can cook some food. Mm. Even if it's a vegetarian. And that, Diane could cook some vegetarian food. She is really good. One day we went to Chastain Park. We went to see Josh Groban. That was a really bad concert because he sang all his songs in Italian. Really? So we couldn't understand oh. anything. Anyways, and she brought Bodhi Nadi. That girl cooked stew Bodhi. Mm. And I brought some butter shot by Tassa. In those days, we open on Sunday. God, Nadi. That was good. We bought food there from um, I from can imagine Proof I of the Pudding. Uh -huh. From Proof of the Pudding and nothing compared. My girlfriend Marilyn was with us. Really? And Marilyn sat there and ate all our roti and body. <laughs> That's so good. That's so good. I'm just... Hi Marilyn. I say my, hi to Marilyn and Randy. I haven't seen you all in a while. So I'm saying let me give you a little shout out. And... Um, I'm going to, I'm, I have somebody to thank mm -hmm. endlessly because after what I told you all yesterday that we, were, we weren't there, what happened while, while we were there and then when we weren't there and our provider, our credit card provider, our merchant services provider is David Sinet and that man, even though we weren't here, he stepped up and he took care of everything because we needed to have everything done. We needed a new drawer. We needed everything. You didn't have to call Dave twice. All you did was call David once and he came and he took care of everything. Now, do you remember David for that um, name of the business? 
First day, he works for first day, but his name. But Daniel used to work. Fine Tech. Our daughter used to work for him and she loves him. His company name is Fine Tech. Boy, he went above and beyond the call of what he was supposed to do for us. Thank you, David. I appreciate it. And that is Fine Tech. And his name is David Finette. If you need information, if you need merchant services and you need a really good man, now I'm not getting paid for this, I'm just doing it because he was so good to me. Then you can reach out to me and I can give you his information because he's that good. That looks good now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that looks good. That looks good. Very good. Yeah. And now while you're doing this, then we're going to do this one. We can always come back to that when we're done. Yeah, yeah. But mm -hmm. um, so, no, I mean to the rest mm -hmm. when we're done. But for right now, we are going to just do this. And then we show everybody how. And then guess what we get to do? Eat. 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 I thought Peter would have been here by now. Yeah. Go oh, take your phone and call him To where he is. We are with him, Pete. I'll continue watching this. Yeah. Hello? Where are you? Oh, wow. Okay. Everything is getting there. Put up the heat a little bit because I'm thinking this is almost done. It's just to cook the, the baigan and with this oil, this oil was hot enough, the baigan wouldn't take long to cook. So this, by the time it's done, I'm going to turn up this, let it get a little brown, and then I'm going to t take it off. That is it. And then I'm going to show you how I'm doing this one. Okay. Love you. Bye bye. He's still there. He's he, 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 he still at work? Yeah. Uh oh. He, he gets feedback. Up. Back. Yeah, yeah. Not work. How are you working today? Ball gum. Oh, no. Nah. He can't make that. Mm -mm. He cannot make that. Wow. So should I turn up the heat a little more now for you? Would I do that? Something like make it straight cook. Right okay, now? Or you Yeah. No dug it dug it. That's enough. Mm -hmm. Let's just get a little drum now. Yeah. And, good. and then that's it. Mm -hmm. So we didn't need any more oil. Because mm -mm. after this, you'll have to throw the oil all the time. Mm -hmm. mm. Good. Mm. Yeah, getting brown. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep, yep. That one won't turn in, Addy. That one brown, watch. Oh, yeah. 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 Pretty. Yeah. Nice color. They're gorgeous. Mm -hmm. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Nada and I make some um, baigani and we make it kind of for mommy and we make this ahina and thing. You want to come and eat something or you're good? No, 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 no. All right. I'll just I make it. Nice. We make baigani. Do you want the fried crispy? And we yeah. make the want the fried crispy. And we made some sahina and I'm going to make some for my mommy. Like my mommy teaches us to make it, the one with the curry. Oh, yeah, yeah, So, yeah, yeah, all right. Yeah, yeah. So, let me go. I'm cooking. All right. Is it a video? Yes. <laughs> okay. 
Okay. Okay. okay. Love you. Bye bye. I know. I know. I know she was down. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. okay, Nadi. That's it. So, so, so you see, Nadi is done, and I am going to. You, all you do is to take and you flour that exactly as I told you. Like if it's a piece of fish that you are frying, you just flour it and you turn the fire and then let that cook because the idea it is to cook the curry down absolutely because you have to cook the curry down and to get the baigan itself crunchy but most importantly it's to cook the curry down because remember you put a fair amount of curry in this now you could put less curry if you want or you could put more curry but i like it like this because this is what i will do when if it wasn't like this and we didn't have all this food I would make a roti a sada roti a lame as I could make a sada roti I'll make one and I will eat this like this is how Shafiq know to eat it this is how my mother taught us she always made a roti for us with this if you need to turn the fire down you have I, enough I don't know. you're good okay mm -hmm. so Quite in November is Diwali this year. November? That I was telling you, sometime mm -hmm. in November. You gonna make some torts that and stuff? Me? <laughs> no, Jane, Jane the same. Jane, Jane is doing a really good job. Mm -hmm. She does. Yeah. But not now, eh? Always. Mm -hmm. She's very talented like that. Is it not? Yeah. Okay. Do you need to put a little fire more? Mm hmm Okay. Okie dokie. Okay. We'll always try out more after. Mm hmm So you want me to make a little thing? Mm -hmm. Or you good here? Yeah. No, I mean with the bag on there or you good? No. You good? Yeah, okay. yeah. All right. All righty. Yeah, what's it done cooking already? Mm -hmm. Let it cook. See, you see it? You see it already? That's how it is. It gets crunchy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It gets crunchy. And nice. Oops. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice. That's so good. That's so good. Yes. Yep. Yep. That looks so good. Mm -hmm. I am ready to eat. Yes, I am. I am so ready. Are you ready to eat, my love? Yep, he's ready too, Nadi. Everybody ready. <laughs> mm -hmm. We'll always make all this another time, mm -hmm. later, or whatever, but for right now, I think we are almost done with that. Almost done. Like this. Almost. Put all these things in the dishwasher later. You want the boat at least? 
You will take out yours, Nag. You will take out yours too. Yeah. Okay. I will have some of each of this chutney. I take in a little bit of this because just had hot. <laughs> that was spicy. Let me see. Oh gosh! Oh gosh! It's so excited. I'm so excited. Okay. And I want you to see. I want you to see what what is happening here. Because when I break this it's crunchy let me dip this in here and so you can see now let me see i need someone to take it out to be able to put hmm you know that crunch that's how crunchy that is when you bite into it you hear it okay Okay, that's what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. That's the bagani. Oh, no, no, that is so delicious. Mmm. 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 Good to go, good mm. to go. Really, really, really good. Oh. Mm hmm. I hope you are jealous because this is <laughs> really good. Now this is crunchy. I want you to hear. I'm, ooh, you break it. When you break it like that, you can hear the crunchiness. I'm going to put some of this to the end here. Mmm. 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 Mm hmm mm hmm That is so good. I'm going to get one of these. Mm, that's so hot. The sahina is flaky because not wrap it nice. Uh-huh. It's so crunchy. It's almost like a like if you're eating a chip part of it. Yeah. It's almost like a chip. Because I'm going to take some of the coconut chutney and rub it into the other, and I kind of fight them with the spice. I eat another piece of this. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. The best one you ever made. Really? I'm killing you. <laughs> the best one you ever made. Mm hmm. Oh, best is the bagani that my mother used to make for us when she used to cook. Kind of hot. Mm. Mm -hmm. See? You could bite through the bayon. I hold on. Are you usually? Oh. Mm. You don't eat the bayon like this. You eat it. Come on now. Go cut things and come on eat. You oh. eat it with a piece of roti. But uh, I just want you to see what we are doing. This is it. I'm going to put some more sauce. It's our next piece. Now let's take it out her food here and she's going to come join us right here in a little minute. Mm, 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 mm. I always tell you all, my mother is still the best cook I know. Oh yeah, that's mm. the truth. Um, I'm, I'm not kidding, that woman could cook. Taste now, taste, taste and tell me what you think. Mm. Oh. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Thank you for joining us. Thank you for, for subscribing. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for liking. And thank you for your comments. Because I live for your comments. I appreciate it. This time, I think we got it right between me and Nad and mm -hmm. my husband. And we'll see you in the next video. Thank you guys. Love you all. Love you all. Bye.